first of all thanks for being here in my youtube channel in this video we are going to solve set number two pie chart that is based on model number two so here they have given two different chart and all the values that are inside the chart is in percentages so p 30 percentage l 15 percentage m 25 percentage right so what they have given is total number of children from five different villages is 2040 and the second chart from this village where the total number of children who are attending the school which is 1450 so out of 2040 only 1450 students are attending the school from five different villages in case if they are asking the students those who are not attending what do you need to do from the total you need to subtract with the students those who are attending the school so resultant answer will be the students those who are not attending the school understood the similar concepts like what we solved in the previous lesson so now let me move on to the question number one what is the respective ratio of total number of children from village o to the number of children attending the school from the same village so what is our target our target to find the ratio so ratio of total number of children from village o right according to chart number one we know that the total number of children from village o is 20 percentage so 20 percentage out of how much students 2040 students is from village o so out of these how many children are attending from village o again it is 20 percent right look at the chart number two chart number two is the value that is children's those who are attending the school so the children's those who are attending the school from village o is 20 percentage so again 20 percentage out of how many students 1450 students so out of 1450 students 20 students are attending the school out of total number of children 20 percentage of children are from village o understood so we need to find the ratio of these two values i think so we can write like this 20 divided by 100 into 2040 so ratio 20 divided by 100 into 1450 so cancel 000 here cancel 000 here so finally we have 204 into 2s yes, which is 408 so again cancel this on two tables sorry we can 5 twos are 10 so remaining will be 1 9 2 90 so try to cancel this on two table that is 204 is to 145 that's it right we can't able to reduce it because here the last number is 4 here the last number is 5 so it is not possible so finally answer for question number one the ratio is 204 is to 145 question number two what is the total number of children who are not attending the school from village L? So our target to find the total number of children who are not attending. So what you need to do? First you need to find the total number of children who are from village L. Minus of total number of children who are attending from village L. Understood? So total number of children from village L minus of total number of children who are attending the school from village L. So resultant will be the children who are not attending the school. Understood? So first let me find the L will be 15 percentage. So 15 percentage out of how many students? 2040. So out of total number of students 15 percentage are from village L. So minus of so village L how many children are attending the school which is 14 percentage. So 14 percentage of children are attending the school. So let me cancel this. We can cancel 0 and 0 here. We can cancel 0 and 0 here. Cancel this on 2 table which is 102. Cancel this on 2 table 5 times. Cancel this on 5 table 3 times. So finally it will be cancel this on 2 table 5 times right. So again cancel this on 5 table 15. So this will be 306 minus of cancel this on 2 table again 5 times cancel this on 2 table 7 times 1 2 5s are 10 45 9 5s are 45 so 9 7s are 63 so remaining will be 6 7 2s are 14 14 plus 6 will be 20 that is 2 not 3 so finally answer for this question is 1 not 3 right when you subtract this 1 not 3 so this will be the answer for question number 2 question number 3 what is the total number of children who are not attending the school from village M and N together? 
so our target to find the children who are not attending the school so first m and n how many children are there m is 25 percentage according to chart number one n is 10 percentage so totally 35 percentage of children who are from both these villages that is 2040 out of 2040 from two villages where 35 percentage of children are there minus of the children who are attending the school from two villages so m will be 32 n will be 12 so add which is 44 percentage so 44 percentage of children who are attending the school from both the villages so out of 1450 so now let me cancel this so 35 divided by 100 into 2040 minus of 44 divided by 100 into 1450 so cancel 00 here 0 here cancel it on two table five times cancel it on two table 102 so 1 fives are 5 7 fives are 35 so similarly cancel this on two table five times cancel this on two table that is 22 so five twos are 10 remaining will be 4 9 fives are 45 so here it is 7 twos are 14 1 7 minus of so 9 twos are 18 here so 9 twos are 18 plus 4 22 22 plus 1 will be 23 so remaining will be 2 4 5 6 6 38 so 7 14 6 38 so here we go 17 14 here so 76 yes 76 so finally answer for this question is 76 will be the total number of children who are not attending the school from village M and N together. Understood? From the total, if you subtract the children, those who are attending the school, so resultant will be the total number of children who are not attending the school. So finally, 76 will be the answer for question number 3. Question number 4. What is the total number of children from village P and M together? So our target to find the total number of children for both the villages that is village P as well as village M. So village P is 30 percentage, village M is 25 percentage, so total will be 55 percentage. So 55 percentage out of how many? 2040. So out of 2040 children where 55 percentage of children are from both the villages that is village P and village M. So let me find the answer for it. It is 55 divided by 100 into 2040. So cancel 00 here. Cancel it on 5 table. That is 2 times. Cancel it on 5 table 11 times. Cancel it on 2 table which is 102. So we need to multiply 102 into 11. So 1020 into 1 will be 102. So 1122. So 1122 will be the answer for question number four question number five the number of children attending school from village l is approximately what percentage we found the clue word that is what percentage right what percentage of total number of children from that village so here is the clue word that is what percentage so what percentage what is the formula x divided by y into 100 so first what they are saying is, let me read the question again, the number of children who are attending the school from village L. So according to chart number 2, the children who are attending the school from village L is 14 percentage. So numerator value will be 14 percentage out of 1450, so divided by the value of y. So the total number of children from that same village, right? So according to chart number 1, where village L is 15 percentage. So 15 percentage out of 2040 into 100. So children, those who are attending the school from village L divided by the total number of children from village L into 100. Got it? So now we need to cancel it. So we can cancel percentage, percentage here. We can cancel 0, 0 here. I think we can cancel it on 5 table. When we cancel this on 5 table, 5 threes are 15. So cancel this on 5 table, 5 twos are 10, remaining will be 4, 9 fives are 45. So cancel this on 2 table, which is 1 or 2, cancel this on 2 table, 7. So let me multiply this, 9 sevens are 63, so remaining will be 6, 7 twos are 14, 14 plus 6 will be 20. So divided by, this will be 306 into 100. 
okay i think uh, if wish we can uh, try to simplify it or otherwise we can write like this 20300 so divided by 306 so 306 20300 right here approximately take a value as 300 because our target to find not an exact value our target to find an approximate value so take this as 20000 take this as only 300 so 20000 divided by 300 it will be six times right so six times here so again we will be getting 20000 again six times here so point something like two three okay we need to find approximate answer we can say approximately 66 percentage will be the answer understood what i did see here 20300 i took this as 20000 denominator we have 306 i have just took as 300 so if you cancel it we will get 00 200 divided by 3 so 200 divided by 3 approximately 66 point point it goes on so i approximately wrote as 66 percentage so this will be the answer for last fifth question so finally thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget to watch the remaining question that is based on model number two so only if you watch all the videos you will be surely able to understand the concept and you can able to crack all the questions in your competitive exams that is based on this pie chart so thank you so much bye